everything in this universe every particle every piece of dirt every organism every part of you everything that exists in all that you see and in that which you do not see is a vibrational basis that is transmitting and receiving constantly and those transmitting and receiving signals are being organized by this powerful law of attraction which says in simple terms that which is likened to itself is drawn so if you set your frequency on I don't have enough money and you stay there long enough that you set your frequency on I don't have enough money and I'm really irritated about it I don't have enough money and I am frightened about it as you set your frequency there even though you may be going through all of the motions that might bring money to others you hold the money that you're asking for away from you because and you'd often don't even realize you're doing it you have tuned yourself to the frequency of not enough and when you tune yourself to the frequency of not enough money or when you tune yourself to the frequency of a physical condition that you do not want when you tune yourself by practice to a vibrational frequency law of attraction cannot buck your current you cannot receive around the signal that you're offering the signal that you're offering equals your point of attraction for example when you see someone who is annoying and you proclaim to yourself or out loud that this is an annoying person that discord that you feel that you would call irritation or frustration or even anger is your indicator that your conclusion your opinion your attitude about the present subject does not match the attitude or the opinion of the source within you because source within you loves that irritating person even though you are finding that irritating person irritating when you love that feeling of love is that feeling of alignment a feeling of hatred is a feeling of misalignment anger misaligned whether you are guilty or blameful misaligned because the source within you will not find fault with you or anyone else and when you do when you proclaim someone unworthy or inappropriate or just plain wrong when you take the time to ferret someone out and point at it and call it wrong in that judging I don't want you I want to push you away and what you're doing away attitude you are and you're free to do it you are activating a vibration that the source within you never activates and how do you know that the source within you is not now activating a similar vibration you feel the discord it's what negative emotion is when you see someone and you appreciate them that feeling of appreciation that wells up in you is your indicator that your vibrational attitude your vibrational opinion matches that of the source within you when you love someone there's no disparity between the vibrational aspects of you and you you are aligned you are allowing you are allowing the fullness of who you are you don't go to a buffet and spend your whole time standing in line telling the nice people behind the counter I don't like that and I don't like that and I don't like that what were they thinking who would put that there why would they put that there I don't even want to know what that is that's not the way you choose from your buffet you select from among it what you want and that's what you intended to do when you came into this physical time space reality you expected to have exposure to life that would help you to identify improvement and you knew that when you out here on the leading edge ferret out and improvement you knew that the larger part of you that would be us that would be source that would be your inner being that would be that non-physical part of you you knew that that non-physical part of you would then hold steady to the improved version that you have carved out of life and that's exactly what happens when you don't have enough money you ask for more whether you use words or not you ask vibrationally and when that rocket of desire that other side of the vibrational wave when that balance occurs the source within you holds steady forevermore your new conclusion about the prosperity that you seek 
But when you look back at the circumstance that caused you to ask for more money and you defend the needing or the wanting of more money by pointing out how hard it is without it or how unjust it is without it or how not fair, how not right, how annoying, how unpleasant, how many others are experiencing it maybe in the same way as you defend or rationalize or justify your improvement request you hold yourself out of vibrational alignment with the improvement that you have requested and you hold yourself instead in vibrational alignment with the problem that caused the solution now this is the thing that we so want you to understand as you're moving through life experience exposed to all kinds of circumstances and events and other people and their ideas and beliefs and desires you can't help but come to a steady stream of conclusions about what from your perspective would be better and as those conclusions emanate from you and the source within you makes them a vibrational reality by holding to the vibrational frequency of them you can then from the moment of the birth of the new desire you can feel what your vibrational relationship is to that improvement that's what your emotions give you your emotions give you moment by moment feedback your emotions let you know whether you're a match to what you want or whether you're a match to what you don't want.